Hey, welcome back. Today we're doing a quick little review on the boat buckle ratcheting tie-down system for your transom. So this is the G2 model, which is all stainless steel. I run a bay boat, so I run it and I do my bass tournaments and freshwater fishing. I do bay fishing. So these are permanently mounted to your trailer, so you need something that's stainless steel. So these G2s are stainless steel, even the spring is stainless steel. I'm not affiliated with them, I'm just giving my review on it because I bought it and I love them. I should have bought these years ago. So this is the boat buckle. You have your ratchet, you have your release tabs, and you just have your strap. So with the strap, all you do is bring it up, hook it. That's it. That strap is tight. Release, undone. There's a tab under this, under the actual ratchet, there's a tab that you have to pull and you can hear it click. You can't really even get a second ratchet on unless you pull real tight, but these straps are not going anywhere. Release, undo, and you're done. These are mounted to the trailer. Normally they're mounted to the steel my, or, my, or the aluminum frame. Mine is set back. So these are actually mounted to the bunk with four inch stainless steel lag bolt. They do come with bolts for mounting. So these are supposed to be mounted to your trailer frame. My trailer frame sits way too far back. So I have a little aluminum bracket that I put on the bottom. It's a little L bracket. And I have the boat buckle mounted to the bracket. And then the bracket bolted with a four inch lag bolt into the actual bunk material right here. So I've done about five trips and I have about 350 to 400 miles on the trailer with these. They have not come loose. Uh, it is very secure. Um, you're gonna have to mount it to your specific trailer anyways. Um, so you can go by standard mounting directions, but if you have an oddball trailer boat, uh, combo that I have or some kind of bay boat like this you might have to look into an alternative But you can find a way to securely mount these okay, so I have both straps just undone I just pulled my boat onto the trailer. I'm gonna strap it up and go home I'm finished here you guys have a great day Boat Buckle, again, I'm not affiliated with them. They do make stainless steel um, standard tie down, uh, transom tie downs. The hooks and their clamp buckle is stainless steel. Those are only like 43 to $47. So if the price turns you off and you just wanna stick with the standard buckles, I'll put a link on that too, or description of the product. And I'll also show it on screen right now. So thanks for watching. Um, I'm not trying to make up your mind. You can make up your own mind what you want. I, I had fun doing this, so I hope you enjoy it and uh, have a great day.